Hey everyone, my name is Christopher, and welcome back to Pokemon Sword and Shield. The series continues, we are back playing Pokemon Shield. And as I said in my previous video, I will continue and I will play Pokemon Sword back to back with Pokemon Shield at my own pace. It's kind of hard playing and recording two games at the same time, let me tell you. Plus editing a whole bunch of other stuff, like theory videos. I'm a busy person. I literally had to go back uh, to uh, my day job right after recording uh, the first video of Pokemon Shield. But like, yeah, and then, oh yeah, and then I came home and then I needed to sleep because I hadn't slept much. But I'm back everybody, I'm back, and we are ready to roll across the lands of the Galar region. So, enough talking, enough dilly-dallying, let's get on with the story. Alright, we are going to be visiting the Professor Magnolia to learn about the secrets of the Dynamax Phenomena. And by secrets, uh, well, I mean, what's there to it? They kind of get bigger, right? <laughs> it just gets bigger! Ugh. Although, I kind of do wonder how it all works. Uh, dear me, I'm sorry, I didn't even notice my guests, question mark. My name is Magnolia. Welcome, young trainers. Now come, let's head indoors. Hmm, yes, of course, yes. Hmm. Ah. Okay. Oh, why, Hop D, I see Wulu has made some new friends. And you must be Christy. Why, yes, of course. That is my character's name. Trust you received the Pokedex from Sonia? I'm sure you'll have it complete in no time. Oh, well. Uh, divine no time, considering how many... Pokemon there actually is in this game in total. Ah, my glasses. Ah, anyway. But yeah, considering how many Pokemon there are in this game, like, I don't know if no time is the right thing, but hey, we'll get there. We'll complete that Pokedex eventually. Eventually. Probably gonna stream that, to be honest. <laughs> uh, I can just see it now. Christopher's stream, gotta catch them all. Uh, I'll probably end up going for years to come. <laughs> probably. Oh, if it's anything like how I end up playing Omega Ruby Alpha Sapphire, oh my god. Oh, Leon, why wouldn't you endorse them? Hop and Christy only just started out as Pokemon trainers. There are still loads they don't know yet. D-Ray, I thought your dream was to have everyone in Galar region become strong trainers, isn't that right? Well, yeah, you're not wrong. The goal's precisely the reason I gave them both Pokemon, in fact. Okay. Right then, in that case, how about this? So let's see if you two can show me such a brilliant battle that I'm left with no choice but to endorse you. What's this endorsing thing, you know? Is it like sponsorship or do we do we get epic graphics on a cape like like our buddy Leon here? Are we going to get paid to do battle? I mean, we already get paid to do battles by the by the losing party. But hey, I mean, having actual sponsorships would be nice. Just saying. <laughs> uh all right. What's well, what's going on here? I see, we are setting up for a poke battle. You remember what I asked, don't you? I think you've got potential, and that's why I want you to be a real rival to Hop. And that's direct from your champion, Leon. Whoa, we're getting the one-to-one, -one, literally right off the bat from a Pokemon champion. That's, it's, that's actually really cool that we actually start off getting trained up by a Pokemon champion right from the beginning and uh, it looks like we get a dialogue choice come at me with everything you have so we can prove to lee that we've got what it takes of course of course we'll give it our all as pokemon trainers our honor is on the line it is on the line indeed hmm all right listen you two the reason i'm unbeatable is because i learned from every battle i see or take part in 
That's how I've gotten to where I am today. So show me something good in this battle. Alright, we'll show him a good fight, won't we, Hop? Okay. Alright. He's probably gonna have more Pokemon in his roster this time. Yep, called it. He's got three now. Okay, so of course he's gonna start off with Wulu. So I'll go with Sobble. And have you gotten a bit stronger, my team? We'll put you to the test. Huh! Cutscenes mid battle. This is gonna be interesting. Alright. Sobble! Use Water Gun! Oh man. Okay. Whoa, that did a lot of damage. Damn. Alright, let's finish it off with Pound. Oh man. Is it seriously only still level 6? My god, man. Train your Pokemon. Do some battles, why don't you? Oh my goodness. Alright. See? My Pokemon level up. Why don't yours? Hmm? Ah, chew to learn bite. That's a dark move if I'm not mistaken, so hmm. Alright, he's gonna send out Score Bunny. Uh no, I think I'll stick around with my um my starter here. Sobble's got uh, the type advantage with water gun. So yeah, I think we'll just <laughs> Oh god. We'll just sweep with water gun. Yep. Yep. Ah, well, it seems like you've learned about type advantages. Uh, yeah, it's totally like I wasn't exploiting that, you know, in our lost battles at all. Eh? Yeah? I don't know, man. Like, eh. It's almost like you forgot. Alrighty. That's more XP. Oh, yeah. Three Pokemon leveled up this time. Nice, 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 nice. Squovit, Lotad, and Rookadi. Okay. Oh, yep. Oh, you want to learn Mist? Cool. Uh, yeah, why not? Why not? Why not? Why not? I'll get rid of Growl for that. Okay. One, two, and ta-da! Lotad forgot Growl. And learn Mist instead. Alright, is Rukadi or Squobet going to learn any new moves? No? Okay. That's cool. I can, I can deal with just taking the stats. Alright, so he's got his own Rukadi. Hmm, it's a flying type. Maybe I ought to switch it up. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah! Let's go with electricity. If I remember correctly, electricity has a type advantage to flying. I think. I think. I think. It's been a while. It's been a while. It'll be a close one, but that's exactly my sort of match. I don't know if it's going to be a closed one, man. I haven't had any Pokemon faint at all in this epic battle to the death. I mean, faint. Yes, of course. To the faint. To the faint. Yes. Hmm. Uh. Jeez. Oh, it hurts. The pain. Ouch. Go get him, Huey. Yeah, you wreck him. It's super effective. I've called it. It does have a type advantage. Awesome, 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 awesome. Nuzzle? Alright. Oh, that's right, Nuzzle does do damage. I forgot that Nuzzle does damage. Hmm. Oh yeah, and it can stun. Not stun, para paralyze. Oh man. I'm getting caught on my word. <laughs> I'm getting it mixed up. I mean, they effectively kind of mean the same thing, except stun is its own status ailment. If I remember correctly. Or maybe, maybe, uh, is there even, oh, I can't even remember at this point. I am so tired, I'm like half delirious. <laughs> I still got more sleep to catch up on. We're getting there, we're getting there. I'm aiming by next video to have fully caught up. Or at least caught up enough to not be semi-delirious. Uh, oof, gutted that I lost, but I'd expect nothing less from my rival. You're damn right. That's right. As your rival, it's our job to show you who's the best. I am the Alpha. I am, yes, the sting of defeat and the joy of victory. Hmm. Alrighty. Does this mean we get endorsed? Were we exciting enough? 
Uh, were we? Oh, no choice at all. He is going to endorse us. Oh, yes. Yeah. Straight off the bat. We got a letter of endorsement. Oh, okay. Hey, it's, uh, yeah, it's like a letter of recommendation, which basically lets us participate in gym battles. Makes sense. Makes sense. I kind of was hoping, you know, it was to do with being uh, paid to uh, a play, but, oh, well, that's, I, I, I can, I can, I can deal with this. That's fine. This is fine. Being able to gym battle is also fine. Uh, oh, wait, what? Honestly, I'd be worried about you still obsessing over that sort of nonsense, but it seems like you really have grown a bit, little brother. Uh, <laughs> woofed. Rip? <laughs> oh, man. Big brother Rip, like, tearing his younger brother a new one about his, uh, his, um, distractions. But, I mean, it makes perfect sense. He's focusing on looking cool and not actually training his Pokemon. Damn it. Like, I mean, I mean, that explains why it's like level six. Anyway, we got another dialogue choice. You and me are going to train up against one another to aim for that champion's title. Well, I'm definitely going to train. I don't know if you are. You seem to be more interested in your Pokeball throwing, but absolutely sure. Why not? Why not? Okay, huh? What's that? <gasps> oh, man, what a pose. That guy knows how to throw a pose. Ooh. Oh, man, the pretty lights. They're so shiny. It's so shiny. Aw. What is it? Christy, would you look at this? They're wishing stars. Since there are two of them, you should take one yourself. All right. Cool. Also, I love the fact that they have basically completely redone all the music it's the same but it's it's different it just ah it gets me man all right so this stone has mysterious power wishing star kind of reminds me of a keystone in a manner of uh yeah okay with one of these in my pokemon can dynamax they're gonna be massive makes perfect sense i guess it pretty much is a keystone <laughs> uh pretty much Pretty, pretty much. Oh, man. Hop. Give it a rest, man. Oh, God. Caps locks. Oh, my God. Okay. Okay. Just chill, bro. Chill. Oh, man. Hop's got no chill. Oh, jeez. Okay. So, if they're a precious resource... Uh... What exactly are we doing? Just randomly carting these things around. <laughs> I'm surprised there isn't, like, some sort of government organization just coming around and <clears throat> confiscating them. Or collecting them. Yeah. Sort of like a forcible acquisition or something. <laughs> I don't know. I mean, I wouldn't be surprised if they actually did that, but... Eh. Or maybe there's an evil team that goes around stealing people's wishing stars. Who knows? Who knows? Oh, hey, Sonya, when did you arrive? Seems I came back home right in time for all the excitement. When did you arrive, though? Oh, okay. Oh, okay, dinner. Yeah, dinner is good. I, mean, I could actually go for some dinner. I might actually get takeout or something. Might get some food delivered. Yeah. Might get some uh, boxes of uh, epic, epic, delicious foods. Hmm. I don't know, I'm kind of got a craving for KFC, but uh, I want to eat healthy, damn it. It's hard. <laughs> Decisions. Decisions. It's morning at last, and time for our adventure to truly start. Okay, Magnolia, what's up? Tell us all about uh, those wishing stars, eh? Huh. Alright. Nope, we're going to talk about that legendary we saw. Okay. Alright, so there was a weird heavy fog, and we tried to fight it off, but yeah, we pretty much passed out. It's all pretty hazy. Oh man, the puns, unreal, ugh. Oh jeez. Okay, ooh, we getting something? What do we get? Ah, oh, our own Dynamax band from The Professor. 
epic. It, it basically is a keystone bracelet. It literally is. Uh, awesome. I mean, I like the redesign. It's it's cool. It's cool. Also, um, for those of you who do not know, Dynamax is Galar Region Exclusive. Alrighty. Anyway, just one of those little tidbit facts that you probably ought to know. Probably. Possibly. Anyway, what are they going on about? What are they going on? Oh, yeah. Okay, they're pretty much just explaining that it makes your Pokemon bigger using the power of your hopes and dreams. Indeed, they will help us fill our Pokedex and defeat other Pokemon. Yeah. Alright, onwards! Onwards with the adventure! Alrighty. Okay, so... Let's... let's go this way. Alright. So, I'm pretty sure... okay. Yep, Hop wants to tell us one last thing before we race. He wants to give us some advice. Okay. Hopefully it's some winning advice for a change. <laughs> oh man, yeah, Pokemon wandering around in the tall grass. What about them? I already know that you can encounter Pokemon in tall grass. Oh, oh, okay. If you whistle at them, you'll be sure to catch their attention. If you're a bit rubbish at whistling, just remember this. Need a fail-proof trick? Press the left stick. <laughs> oh, that's terrible. Ugh, okay. I might have a, have a go at whistling, though. Alright, you remember which her station? Yep, sure do. Okay, so we're gonna make our ba way back to the station. But before that, I might just have a crack at whistling. What does it do? Oh, it get yeah, it actually does get their attention. Okay, cool. Alright. Onwards to the station, I say. To the station. I'm glad I defeated every trainer along the way, or this would be kind of annoying. Hey, wait a minute. What's up? Oh, oh, damn it. I thought it was like an NPC. Aw, oh, damn it. I already caught a Yamper. Oh, well. This is fine. I'll just run. Bye bye, Yamper. Scamper along, little one. Okay, so. Let's. Let's see if I can sneak. Sneak through the grass. Yeah. Oh, no. Don't need to battle you, buddy. Eh. Ah! No battle. I'm trying to get back to town. Ah! Ah! Oh, man. There is so many, so many bushes of tall grass. I actually kind of forgot how many there were. Oh, you're waving? What's up? Okay, you saw him sneaking off to the station? Okay. Cool. He's probably already beat us there. Considering, yep, there we go. It's already there. Called it. Uh, also, I love the fact that you can actually see um, there's, uh, what do you call it, a an actual language. And it's, it's, uh, it's, uh, it's literally its own unique thing in the world of the Galar region. Like, obviously I can't really read that or understand that right now, but... Uh, maybe if I do my homework later on, I might. Alright. What's he on about? Not one. What are you doing this whole time? You want to go... You want a team? Oh, okay. Okay. Cool. Cool. He gave us a technical machine with the move Swift. Cool. Cool. And it never misses. Oh, of course it never misses. Oh, man. That's terrible. And you move in a flash. <laughs> okay. Onwards. Onwards to Motostoke. Oh, that's that's gonna really trip me up trying to pronounce that. Motostoke, 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 Motostoke. Oh, it's like Peter Piper picked a pickled pepper or something. Yikes. I have to practice saying that. <laughs> oh, not quite so fast, you two. Hop's mum. Okay, our mothers are here. And that makes sense. Yeah. Fair enough. I mean, uh, I said it, or I'm pretty sure I said it in my last video, but I really love the fact that they actually show a little bit more parental instincts from the trainer's parents. Uh, like, it's only in the dialogue options that you really see them kind of care, but 
it's nice to see on a behavioral level that they actually show they care about you <laughs> and that um like yeah they they actually are looking out for you oh actually that occurs to me i completely forgot there's a clothing store that we can um check out i might actually just backtrack a little bit and go do that um hmm where we're off I mean, it sounds like it would be a bit more thoughtful to just say we're off. Saying we'll be fine is probably, like, gonna discount their feelings or something. So we'll just go saying we're off. Bye, guys. Bye. Uh, does that mean we're gonna hop on the train, though? Uh, uh okay. Well, I guess we can, we can come back to the character customization in a little bit. Let's just, um, let's just explore the open world uh, aspects of the game um because yeah this is this is the part where you actually get to explore um and see just how big this game actually can be um and it's it's literally the tip of the iceberg as well it's probably I'm, I'm i'm assuming it's probably going to be the smallest area that you can explore but it's still pretty damn big like just what just wait till we get there just wait till we get there you'll see You'll see. All right, here we are. Hey, Mr. Station Master, isn't uh, this the wild area? What are we stopped here for? Uh, yeah, this is the wild area, no mistake. Okay. Oh, <laughs> a flock of Wulu. Of course, a flock of Wulu blocked us off. Uh, all right, brilliant. Yes, of course. Mm-hmm, definitely brilliant. Okay, yeah, it is a good opportunity, but, um, your enthusiasm is, like, over 9,000, Hop. Oh, my God. Like, damn. <laughs> it's making me feel positive, and I'm already positive. Oh, man. Oh, look at that view, everyone. It's gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. Oh my goodness. Uh, hi there, would you like to rest your Pokemon? Sure would. Might as well heal up our Pokemon before we go adventuring. Alright, look at that. Look indeed. Oh, Alright, that's Modestoke way off that way. Okay. Mm-hmm. And between there and here are countless new Pokemon waiting to be met. Coolio. Oh, hello. And if it isn't Sonia. All right. How's it going, Sonia? Hair is fabulous as usual. Literally 3D, I must say. Okay. Um. Oofed. Yeah, no, that does sound rough. Oh, jeez. Feels bad, man. Ah, uh, never you mind that. Nothing to worry yourselves over. Besides, I'd be quite curious about that Pokemon you two met in the forest. I've been thinking I should look into it, so the timing works out fine. If I discover something really huge, then maybe even Gran will admit I've got some talent. Yikes. Being adults, uh, has got its own challenges, eh? I think just being, you know, uh, your usual self. It doesn't matter whether you're an adult or child. Everyone's got challenges, man. <laughs> uh, all right. Well, um, apparently Hoff's off to go stick his head in as many of those red glowing dens as he can find. Oh, jeez. I'm not going to take that out of context at all. And you shouldn't either. <laughs> uh, all right. Let's, let's just... Get going. <laughs> oh, man. Okay. You'll find spots here and there in the wild area that emit a red beam of light. If you think you're up to it, check them out. There'll be Dynamax Pokemon lurking inside. So, with that, how about I send you off with a little treat from me? Aw, treat! Pokemon Box Link. Okay. Oh, uh, sick. So we can actually access the storage box 
pretty much on the go anywhere, anytime, any place. We don't necessarily need a PC, although I'm assuming it's going to have limited functionality. It probably won't be able to carry everything, like all our Pokemon. But I'm guessing that it's probably going to let us have a fair amount of leeway. Yeah, probably. Or I could be wrong and it lets us access the entire, like, storage box. Who knows? Who knows? But I guess we'll just have to wait and find out. Let's go exploring. Oh my god. Catch all the things. Explore all the things. Oh, right. Let's let's get this wind go. Also, um, I like the fact that uh, it, it's kind of funny because uh, people commented that wind gulls just kind of like hover around, but like it makes kind of sense that they sort of hover around. They're supposed to be based off um, like a, a seagull or a, a, an albatross kind of idea where it just constantly glides and every now and then it flaps just to maintain its height. Um, but uh, it does kind of look funny that it's it's hovering on the spot, but I mean, what do you guys want? Uh, uh, you want to see it just flying across the screen all the time? It pretty much would just be like, hi, bye. <laughs> Uh, wait, what am I doing? I need to get, I need to get Huey out. It, this is a water time. I'm attacking it with water moves. Ugh. Ugh. Ah, uh, whatever. We'll just use Pound. That should do the trick. Probably. Maybe. I mean, I'm assuming. Oh. We were confused? I wasn't even paying attention. <laughs> uh, okay. You know what? Stuff it. I'm just gonna get Huey out. Okay. Good job. We're gonna switch you out now. Okay, go get him, boy. Ooh, water gun. Good thing we have a type advantage. Although, kind of bad that we're slightly under-leveled, but this is fine. This is fine. All right, Huey used Nuzzle. It was super effective, oh yeah. Alrighty, and oh, I completely forgot I was actually gonna catch that. Oh well, whatever. It's good XP. Uh, water pulse. Yep, yep, yep. I want that move. We are going to get rid of bind for that move. Yes, indeed, we do. Okay. Ah, uh, Chudel uh, uh, leveled up too. Cool. Cool, 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 cool. I wonder what the evolution animation looks like. Okay. Anyway, that aside, let's... Let's just, um... Uh, actually, no, maybe I might just backtrack a bit and then heal... Oh, we got a note. The large Pokemon you see wandering around in the wild area are strong. If you try battling one and it seems like you're in over your head, try to run. Run like the wind. Okie dokie. Uh, how do I run? Is it the B button? I'm gonna try and figure that one out. Oh wait, no, you don't heal my Pokemon. That's alright. You heal my Pokemon. Yeah, you do. Alright. Oh, thank you. Thank you kindly. Oh, link tray. Oh, oh, okay, I pressed the Y button by accident. And, oh, that brings up my menu. I okay. Oh. Whoa. Whoa. How did I miss that giant ass looking onyx? Uh, hi there. Let's battle. Unless you're over leveled, in which case, let's let's not do that. Let's um, let's just go our separate ways and um, you know, just chill. And oh my god, you're literally more than twice as strong as I am. We're done. Oh uh, crap. This ain't good. Uh, that that's not good. Uh. This is bad. <laughs> That's not good. That's not good. We're done. Goodbye. <laughs> oh, rip. I have to go back and heal up again. Oh, no. Oh, no. Ah, feels immensely bad. <laughs> uh, actually, while I'm here, I might as well... Might as well go and buy some items. I actually skipped something I could have looked into as well. 
Um, just one sec. I might get some more Pokeballs. Might get like how many more? Uh, yeah, we'll get about five more. Why not? Cost about a grand. Get some potions. Get about six more. Maybe? No, no, no. I don't need to get a revive. I can just go back and get my Pokemon revived. But let's let's have a chat with these people over here. Hey, have you and an Eevee had a... Nah, it was just my imagination. Sorry to bother you. Uh, what about you? Hey, have you and a Pikachu had a... Question mark? Oh no, I think I was mistaken, don't mind me. Now, the thing is, um, if you've played Let's Go Pikachu, and I have, I have, just not on this save file, um, but on my other one I have, and I got a Pikachu from here, but basically if you've played Let's Go Pikachu or Let's Go Eevee, these two will give you an Eevee or a Pikachu. Okay? That's just something you should know. Um, I'll probably uh, end up just coming back here. Oh, no, wait, I don't need to. That's right. I was just going to play till I completed up to the point where I did on my actual main save file and then continue on from there. What's that? All right. Pokeballs. Nice, nice. I just bought a bunch. All right. Let's, uh, oh, another note. I was going to have a go at that berry tree over there. Cooking at your camp can restore HP to your Pokemon and even the PP, aka the Poke Power, they need to use their moves over and over. Okay, or you can perk them right back up with a piping up plate of curry. Cool. Cool. Okay. Coolio. It's a berry tree. Do you want to shake it? Okay. Whoa. Okay, we literally shook it. That's a pretty thick tree, not gonna lie. Like, that is a really thick tree. Um, there's one berry on the ground. Yep, yeah, okay. Cool. Cool, 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 cool. I am just gonna leave it here for a second, guys. I'm gonna take a break, and I'll be right back. Uh, all right guys, I am back and yeah, look, I just needed to eat dinner, uh, but you know, here we are and let's jump straight into a raid. All right, let's have a look at these Pokemon dens. I still, um, like, I don't know what this energy is, the 300W, but uh, yeah, look, uh, <laughs> all in due time. Alright, defeat a Dynamax Pokemon and you'll get a chance at catching it. Additionally, there are some rare items that you can only obtain by battling Dynamax Pokemon. Uh, okay. No. There's nothing that indicates what that currency is, but oh, whatever. Uh, and there's nobody showing up, so let's just hit ready. Okay. Start battle. I don't have four trainers. We'll find some others to help you out. Is that okay? Uh, sure. Why not? That's that's fine. This is fine. I am happy with this. Whoa. That was quick. Oh my god. Oh my god. A Dynamax Bunnelby. That is terrifying. That thing is massive. Yeah. Okay. That's that's somewhat terrifying. <laughs> Oh my god. Alright. Let's let's Dynamax and we'll go Max Geyser. Straight on that Bunnelby. Now what I'm kinda interested in is the fact that um it got players in super quick. I'm almost I'm almost getting the feeling that those are bots just because of how quickly uh those players kinda populated. Uh, I wouldn't be surprised if that's the case. Uh, I'll probably I'll look into that. Uh, hopefully by next video as well, just so that you know we got an answer quickly as to what that actually is and whether or not you know it auto populates with bots or it actually just finds random players nearby. It wouldn't be cool if it was random players nearby, but eh, I'm not phased. Okay. What's a going on? Whoa! Damn, Dynamax Water Pulse is awesome! Like, 
the scaling is off the charts. <laughs> oh my god. Wow. Okay. Yeah, wow. What? Oh, okay. It didn't... It di Okay. So it took a fat chunk of health off him, but it didn't exactly take a lot of health off him. Like, I was kind of hoping it would at least take two-thirds of his health, but eh. Oh well. It's... it's... decent, is what it is. Oh man. Damn! I reckon one more attack cycle and we should be good. Ooh. Or maybe this will be it. Oh. Uh, no. No. Oh, wait. No, hang on. Maybe it's gonna have an attack? No, it's not. It's not. not. Okay, whatever. Let's go with a different attack. Let's go with Max Strike. Let's go with that. That sounds striking. <laughs> oh, God, that was terrible. I am not sorry at all, though. Okay, the storm grows even stronger. What even is that storm anyway? It's like a massive black hole, like right above him. Also, damn! Max Strike is really badass looking for a move. Huh. Alright, so we're gonna catch a Dynamax Pokemon now. Oh. Oh, our bracelet is changing that into a Dynamax Ball. Oh my god. Oh my god. Dynamax Battles is actually really cool. <laughs> uh, just wow. And the scaling makes it like ridiculous and like epic, like super epic. It's almost like a battle of Godzilla in a way, you know? <laughs> like, it's like Pokemon meets Godzilla versus King Kong or something. I don't know. I just... It's, it's awesome. It's awesome. No, I don't want to nickname the Bunnelby. That's fine. Alright, let's just go around doing uh, raids and catching Pokemon where we can. Yeah, I already caught a Bunnelby. I'm gonna go, well, oh, a Butterfree. Huh. Ooh, hello. Who be you? Love to cook, you've come to the right place. Got all the finest ingredients right here. Uh, okay. Oh, this is... This is that curry stuff that they mentioned earlier. Huh. Awesome. Whoop, whoop. Oh, a Metapod. Come back here. Come back here. I'ma catch you. I will catch you. Oh, man. Hopefully, it knows more than just Harden. I mean, it'd be kind of sad if, if it didn't, though. Because <laughs> I won't exactly be able to fight back at all, but oh well. Oh my god. Oh, classic Metapod. Oh well. Guess I'll just have to level this one up by proxy. Through XP share. Pokeball. Go! Get in the ball. Get in my belly. I mean my ball. And a ball, nice. All right, now I'll just evolve that into a Butterfree and then I'll have a Pokemon that can put other Pokemon to sleep. Thus matching, matching, making the capture process a little bit easier. Hmm. I am down with this. All right, Metapod's data added to the Pokedex. Even though it is encased in a sturdy shell, the body inside is tender. It can't withstand a harsh attack. Okie dokie. No, no nickname for you. Uh, I'll send you to the box and deal with you later. Yes. Now, where am I going? Whoa, hello. Let's catch this guy. Yeah, I want to catch this one. A Diggersby. Whoa. Whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, it's level 15? Oh, I don't think I can hang. Oh, God. Oh, we'll give it our best shot. Oh, okay. He's, uh, he's focusing. He's concentrating intensely. What will it do, though? Oh, whoa. 
That's, that's, um, that's a lot of damage. <laughs> like, damn, well, that is a lot of damage. <laughs> oh, good. Ah, no, that's a lot of damage. Ugh. Ugh. Oh, no. And my speed's fallen, so who knows? I might have lost the advantage there. Uh, okay. Let's just try throwing balls at it, and hopefully... We have a good time. Hopefully, it just gets in there first time round. Hopefully. Hopefully. I have my doubts. Ah, and you proved my doubts right. Damn it. I was hoping you'd prove me wrong. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Ah. That's not good. Uh, I'm going to have to whittle you down with a couple of other Pokemon then. Okay. <clears throat> Who am I going to go with? Uh. Uh. Hmm. Let's go with Rookity, or Rookie. I'm gonna call him Rookie. Yeah. From now on, you shall be known as Rookie. And... Hone Claws. Let's go with Hone Claws. Yet to test that one out. Oh, okay. Tell me that doesn't actually increase his attack power. Oh, wait, what if that increases his ability to hit you critically? Oh. Oh, oh my. Okay. Power trip then. That didn't... Yeah, okay. I mean, it raised his stats. I was hoping to just damage him a little. Damn it. Okay. Uh, that might be... That might be enough, actually. But maybe just one more to be safe. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Ugh. Okay. Okay. We're good. We're good. I think... I think... That is enough. Alright, now let's try throwing a Pokeball at it. <clears throat> Alrighty. Pokeball go! Oh, rip. Oh, no. Oh, oh. Oh, oh my. Okay, it doesn't affect. Uh, what? No, 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 no. Oh, I hit the wrong button. Oh, my God. Yeah, okay. Uh... The music sounds tragic and sad, just like that situation. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm... I am sad. <laughs> I am just sad. Ah, uh, jeez. Oh well. Such is life. You don't always get what you want when you want. Nonetheless, I will catch one. I will catch me a Diggersby someday. Hi. Oh, no, no, no. You don't see me. You see nothing. Yes. Mm. I'm just going to go into this den over here. Yeah. Uh, that's, that's, uh, that's right. Yeah. Ah, I hit invite again. Ah, damn it. Ah, whatever. Moving on. Moving on. What Pokemon is that? What is that? A uh, some sort of worm type Pokemon? Oh my God! It's a Caterpie. <laughs> that is a uh, kind of scary. <laughs> like, if there was something I definitely wouldn't want to see in real life become super big, it's a caterpillar. Those would be terrifying to see, giant-sized. Let me tell you. Uh, thankfully, we've got an electric-type Pokemon that we can Dynamax. And I'm pretty sure... Pretty sure Bug-type takes double damage. Or does it take quad damage to electric? I can't remember, but... I mean, I... I think... I think Bug has a weakness to electric? I can't remember. But, yeah. We'll see what happens. We'll see what happens. Oh, God. What? 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 What the hell was that? What in the hell was that? Uh. Oh, okay. Um, uh, oh, okay. 
Okay. I... No. No. I need to heal. Yikes. Dear God. That's not okay. <laughs> what in the hell was that move? What even? Oh, man. Yeah, do a normal move like tackle or something. None of this weird butterfly stuff that literally like almost insta kills you. Yikes. Oh, man. Okay. None of you guys had much of an effect. So I'm gonna go with Max Lightning. Ah. Uh, not that move again. Oh my god. It's like literally some sort of bug type nuclear bomb explosion or something. I don't know. <laughs> it's. Uh, all I know is it's super powerful. Like, ridiculously powerful. Oh, man. Oh, rip Caterpie. Uh, Alright. Uh, that's... That's bad. Yeah, that's actual bad. Uh, I don't know how we're gonna go with just Nuzzle. Ugh. Oh, no. Uh, no. Okay. Bug Bite? Yeah, as long as you do... As long as you stick to small, normal kind of looking moves, and none of those weird, exploding bug moves, <laughs> we'll be okay. <clears throat> Ugh. <clears throat> hey, Jolteon's back. Excellent. Alright. Back at it. Let's do it. And am I going to be able to get... I'm, I'm kind of hoping that we'll give it a status ailment like Paralysis from Nuzzle. Ugh. Looks like we're the ones that are having our stats affected. Rip. Okay. Ooh. Double kick. Yeah. Hmm. Didn't do much damage. Ooh. What about Mega Punch? Ah, wow. This 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 Caterpie is actually incredibly tanky. Like insanely tanky. I don't even. I don't even. All right. Let's see if we can finish this in one final attack cycle. Yeah. No? Wow, it's so little damage you can barely even see it on the health meter. Ugh. Oh, damn. A critical hit. Nice. I think that's... That's it? Yeah, that's... That should be it. Oh, yeah. We win. We win. Now, because that was a ridiculous Caterpie, I might actually catch that and level that one up. Never mind that Metapod I caught. I'm gonna go with this one. This one seems to be... Adequate. Yes. Adequate is... Is a word I could use. You gonna get the ball? Come on. Yeah, that's a good Caterpie. Okay. Now what am I gonna nickname you? I'll think of something. Uh, next? Oh, well, you get Dy Dynamax candy? I didn't even know what that... I didn't actually notice that before, but... Huh. Its short feet are tipped with suction pads that enable it to tirelessly climb slopes and walls. Cool. And that is exactly why I wouldn't want this thing giant-sized. That is nightmare fuel. All right. Well, that's that one done. Maybe... Whoa. Okay, nope. Nope. Let's go this way, cross that bridge, and then, um... Do that one raid over there, and then we'll head back, buy an outfit. Whoa! Oh, that's a battle. 
Okay. Ooh, a Pancham. Hell yeah, I want a Pancham. Let's go get us a Pancham. Oop. Okay. All right. So we're a little bit low, but hopefully our one level up uh, makes all the difference. Oh no, don't fall for the taunt. Oh, sweet, a status ailment. Okay, do a tackle. Good boy, Huey. Oh, that barely did anything. Okay. <laughs> uh. Well, let's let's stick with Nuzzle. Seems like Nuzzle seemed to do a little bit more damage than um, Tackle did. Oofed! Oh my God, we just got slapped by that Pancham. <laughs> uh, let's let's switch you out, boy. We're gonna go with uh, Rookedy, and um, hopefully we'll have a better time. Ugh. Uh, actually, I might head back and heal up. Hmm. Yeah, I might head back now after this battle. Because I just realized how, like, how utterly wrecked my team is right now. So let's, uh, let's do, let's do Power Trip. Hopefully this doesn't one-shot him. Oh, uh, definitely won't one-shot him. <laughs> uh... Yeah, that was uh, somewhat uh, weak sauce, if I do say so myself. Um, Rookie, you've got some splaining to do. You're at least two levels higher than Pancham. E, that's better. Okay, defense stats down, but it doesn't matter because we're gonna catch him. All right. So we have a status ailment, and he's low HP. This should be in the bag, or in the ball, if I speak a little bit more uh, practically. Oh man. Uh, yeah. Look, I, I'm I am shameless for those puns. I and I'm not gonna apologize, guys. <laughs> I'm not gonna apologize at all. Uh, hey, Huey leveled up. Nice, 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 nice. Oh, good boy, you learned by. Okay. Uh, Pancham's data. Let's have a look at you. You're a fighting type. Wanting to make sure it's taken seriously, Pancham always... Oh, Pancham's always giving others a glare. But if it's not focusing, it ends up smiling. Oh, okay. Uh, uh, what am I gonna nickname? Ugh, okay, I'll come up with one later. You can enter my party, and I will switch you for, uh, do I want to, Lotad. Yeah, I'll switch you with Lotad. That'll do. Okay. And, oh, oh crap, okay. Where am I going? Oh, uh, hi, Pancham. No, nah, I don't want to battle you. You guys are... Pretty tough, if I do say so myself. Yeah. Hmm. Oh, whoa. Oh, my. What? Wait, what? Okay. I'll have to come back and catch those. Maybe it's a time of the day thing. Hmm. Hey, what's this? Oh, a jar of honey? Okay. Cool. Oh, wow, there's literally jaws of honey everywhere. Ugh. Interesting. <laughs> All right. Uh, yep, 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 yep. I definitely want and need to rest my party. Hmm. Uh, I wonder if they sell revives. I need to get myself uh, a bunch of those. Uh, here to buy. Uh, revive, yeah. Ah, oh. I mean it's helpful, but nah. Yeah, nah, I take that back. Uh, Wedgehurst Station. Yeah, I want to go to Wedgehurst. Awesome, that was really quick. Damn. Like that was actually really quick, like super fast. 
All right, now that we're back in Wedgehurst, we're gonna take a brief stop right over here. And um, we're gonna check out the outfits uh, and just have a bit of fun with the uh, character customization. I forgot to do that earlier and I'm just catching up with it. Um, so let's have a bit of fun with it. Uh, I wonder if they get a, uh, a a pink. Yeah, they do have a pink one. Awesome. Yeah, I'll get that. Damn, 2K. Oh my god. What the heck? That is expensive. Uh, yeah, that's uh, that's very expensive. <laughs> Damn. Um, hmm. Wait, what is? What? Arcanine. Oh my god, it's 30k? Uh, <laughs> yeah, maybe... Let's, let's, let's go with the, uh, the, um, uh, shuckle. We'll go with a nice shuckle. Um, that'll do. And... What else? Um... Definitely want a black jeans of some sort. Maybe... Do I want faded black or the normal black? I'll uh, go with this one. Whoa, that is incredibly expensive jeans. 7.8k? Damn. Okay, let's see what else we can buy. Uh, we can get bags? Cool. Alright, actually, I better watch how much money I'm spending. I'm spending a lot of money here. <laughs> Maybe I go with the black and the gray. Ooh, but the blue. Ah. Uh. Decisions. Damn it. I'll go with the white and black. Yeah, we'll do that. And, yep. Definitely want to equip that. What kind of hat do I want to wear? Hmm. Black. Green. Yellow. Ooh, yellow. Kind of want the yellow one. Oh, there's also pink. Hmm. Yeah, I'll go with yellow. We'll go with yellow. And what else? What else? Can we get glasses? Oh my god, we can. We actually can. Oh, that's fab. Oh, that is actually so fab. Alright. Uh, black glasses? Uh, maybe. Nah, I don't, I don't exactly feel like getting glasses. What about gloves? Ooh. Ooh. Ooh, yellow? Mm, maybe not. I don't, mm. It needs to match. Or something needs to match with it, I feel like. Hmm. Maybe... Hmm, white? No. Let's go... Let's go with pink? Yeah, we'll go pink. Let's go with pink. That'll do. And we will keep the boots as they are. Done, done, and done. All right. All right. Let's get out of here. Let's get out of here and head on out to the next town. All right. Awesome. Check out our new digs. That is actually so cool like ah why can't you get a good close-up there i wish you could zoom like the controls in zelda or look first person at things that that would be so good okay let's go to wild area once more and make our way across huh <sighs> all right so what do? Actually, do you have anything new to say? Oh no, you're just telling me about Pokemon Link Box again. Okay, whatever. Yep, thank you. Thank you. Now, how am I gonna make my way across? Hmm. Whoa. Hello. Uh. Hmm. Okay. So I could go long, 
but there's literally no, no ray battles along the way. Okay. Also, how do I how do I get in the water? I really want to get in the water and travel across. And I know that there are Pokemon in the water. Ooh, hello. Ooh, oh, okay. Is that um? I might actually catch that. Unless you're too powerful, in which case I'm just gonna run away. What level? Ah, uh, fifteen. Uh. Uh. Do I want it that badly? No. Ah, uh, what? Come on, man. You serious? Ugh. Okay. That's. Now, now I'm slightly, slightly salty. <laughs> like, it seems to be just like a default thing that you can't run away the first time around. Like, why? Excuse me? Ah, uh, now that you're par paralyzed, maybe I actually can run. Ah, uh, what? Come on. Ah, oh, man. Damn it. Damn it, damn it, damn it. Okay. Well, that's not good. Now we can actually get away, but ah. Oh, that's so frustrating. Hey, what's that? What is that? Oh, oh. What? No, I don't want the Krabby. I want this one. A whooper. Yeah, let's catch that whooper. Okay. Oh, it's hailing. Okay. Well, maybe power trip? Oh, I hope that's not too much damage. Oh, what am I talking about? That barely did anything. Okay. Well. Maybe I might need to switch things out. Hmm. Yeah, okay. Let's switch it up. Uh, who am I going to put out there? Yeah, look, I'll probably put Sobble out. Yeah. Let's go with Sobble. All right, he's just going with a good old-fashioned tail whip. Ah! How strong is that whip? Oh, that's right, it's a level 8. All right, I'll use pound, because I don't exactly want you to faint, but I do need you to take damage. What? Water gun? <laughs> okay. Uh, sure. That, like, barely even tickled. And I think that lowers you just enough. Okay. Oh, no. That's not ideal. Oh, actually, that helps me. Uh, okay, let's throw some Pokeballs at it. I think it's ready to be caught. Yeah. Alright, let's first, second, third. And nice. All right, we caught us a, um, oh my god, a wo whooper? Yeah. Oh my god, I don't know why the name eluded me for a second there. Literally, like, I just had a mind blank. Oh my god. All right, what a ground type. While walking on land, it covers its body with a poisonous film that keeps its skin from dehydrating. Cool. Um... Mmm, don't think I need to hold on to this one. I have enough water Pokemon in my team. Like, more than enough. Whoa, hello. Uh, nope. What is that thing? Uh, that doesn't sound good. No, that doesn't sound good at all. I'm gonna go, whoa! Wait, what? Hi. Let's, uh... Let's do battle. Oh, it's a Purloin. Aw, I'm a catch you. What would I name you, though? 
Hmm. Maybe I'll name you Flo. <laughs> well, yeah, uh, after our our cat. Okay. All right. Although if you get confused a lot, I'm changing your name to Maddie. All right. Let's go with Peck. See how that goes. Come on, rookie. Use Peck. Ooh. Okay. Oh. Oh, nice. It barely does anything. Well, that's good. This is to my advantage. Hmm. Uh. What? Oh, okay. It didn't lower my accuracy. Hmm. Wonder why. Oh, wow. Power Trip barely does anything. Okay. Hmm. Maybe I'll just stick with Peck. I don't want to switch out to something stronger because I'll run the risk of knocking it out. So what I will do, I'll just go the distance in this battle and I'll duel it out. And it'll take a while, but bit by bit I'll wear it down and then I'll finally be able to catch it. Oh, it's my ability. It's Rookie's Keen Eye ability. Hmm. Awesome. Okay. We're just about ready to start throwing Pokeballs at it. Let's do it. Uh, Pokeball, go! Go! Also, our character looks so cool with the new clothes. Oh, whoa, you actually broke free. Okay. Uh, that's not good. Uh, yeah, that's definitely not good. We gotta catch you before the, um, the storm gets you. Yeah. Come on, man. Get in the ball. Get in the ball. Uh, don't do that. No, don't do that. No. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Anything but the storm. Not the storm. Alright. Lucky lost. Ugh. Come on. Just get in the bowl, man. It's for your own good. The storm is literally, like, about to wreck you. Oh my god. Uh, you're about to faint. Uh, you'll be very lucky if you survive this. No, no, no. Ugh. Okay. Alright. This is honestly the lucky last Pokeball. If you don't get in there, you're gonna die. Or faint, or whatever. Come on. Two. Third. No! Oh. Ah, uh, that's... That's a bit sad. Ah, uh, feels bad, man. All that effort, and nothing to show for it except XP! Ugh. Damn it. Oh. <laughs> that, that, that is just sad. That is honestly just sad. <laughs> Uh, Rookie, you want to learn Fury? Nah. I don't want it. I don't want Fury attacks. I don't particularly care for Fury attack. Brave Bird, on the other hand, that's a pretty good move. Was Is that a Vanillux? Uh, not sure. But, I'm gonna move on. We are gonna move on. What is that? What was that? Ooh. Oh, oh, okay, you're gone. Hmm. Ooh, 50W. I have no idea what it is used for, but cool. Hmm. Oh. What's up with that? Is that the Lotad? Like, the really powerful Lotad? Oh, man. I think it's hilarious that, like... It's the most scary. Ooh, a snow run. Hello, snow runt. Might catch you. Yeah. Hmm. Ah, uh, you're level 14. Okay, let's switch out then. Let's go with, uh. Let's go with. Hmm. Yeah, let's go with Grubbin. Is it Grubbin? Or is it Grubbin? I can't remember. Grubbin. 
Okay, or Grubin. Ooh, whoa. Okay. Fosnoran. <sighs> Okie dokie. How am I gonna go about this? Fight. So we got Bite, Bug Bite, Mud Slap. Mm. Let's go with Bite. See how that goes. Oh, what? Avoided? Now that's just rude. Ugh. It's because you keep increasing your evasiveness. Alright, let's try again. Whoa! Nice! Aw, oh, sick! And because it, it causes flinch. Yes! I am down with the bite. Bite's good! Ah! Unless you... Ugh. Damn it. Damn it, damn it, damn it. Ah, oh, and you're self healing. This is gonna be a tough battle. Alright, get you down now that you've flinched. Might be able to catch you this turn. Ugh, oh, unless you self heal. Ugh, whatever. We'll bite you one more time. And that should be it. You'll self-heal a little bit back, but it should be good. Probably. Uh, okay. Yeah, yeah, that was to be expected. Alright, now let's just give this a shot. Alright, we've only got 11 Perkables left. Yikes, we've been really using them. We've been burning through them. Okay, come on. Almost. Yes! Gotcha! Awesome! Snow Run will be a good um, addition to my team because he, uh, it's an ice type, which is helpful. Okay, what's the Pokedex gotta say? It can only survive in cold areas. It bounces happily around even in environments as cold as a negative 150 degrees Fahrenheit. Okay. Nope. No nickname needed. Add to my party. Who am I going to switch up with, though? Hmm. No. No. Uh, Rookie, maybe. Yeah, Rookie. Yeah. Okay. Now let's... Whoa. No. Okay. Carefully just switch out my team. No, we'll put you up in front. And let's just have a peek at what Pokemon that is. Hmm. I have a funny feeling it's a dragon type. Hang on. Uh. Oh, wait, no, wrong bag. Let's go here. If it is a dragon type, I'm gonna switch it out. My, I'm gonna switch out my first Pokemon with a fairy type. And we'll see how it goes. All right, don't invite others. We are the Bot Squad. Let's go. All right. Butt Squad, deploy! Uh, it's a giant purloin. Oh, wasn't a dragon type, but I'm happy it's a purloin. Because I really want a purloin. <laughs> and ugh, that other one got away. Uh, Dynamax. And uh, why don't we go with Max Starfall? Hmm, super effective. Wait, what? What type is that? Is that a dragon cat type? Not cat type, but a dragon cat, I meant to say. <laughs> is, is that a dragon type cat? Huh. Okay. Uh, Cleffa, you're scary. <laughs> uh. Oh, uh, okay. What is that? No, seriously. I'm really curious now.
Ooh. Okay, so... Brick parade. Whoa, we've done a lot of damage to this purloin. And this is going to be super effective, apparently, so... Yikes! Oh my god. Wow. Wow, this is literally going to be just, like, two attack cycles. Tops. Like, wow. I don't even... <laughs> I don't even, guys. This is probably the most easiest Dynamax battle I have had all night. Oh my god. Damn! Woo! Alright! Let's catch it! Oh man, I'm super curious. I am super duper curious about the Pokedex entry. I really want to know what type this, this Pokemon is. What is a Purloin? Is it a dragon? Uh. Come on. One more. There we go. Finally, we caught a purloin. <laughs> Man, that was tough. Like, ugh, just like the whole time trying to catch one of these. All right, all right, what does it say? Oh, it's a dark type. That's why the fairy move was super effective. All right. Opponents that get drawn in by its adorable behavior come away with stinging scratches from its claws and stinging pride from its laughter. Uh, okay. Huh. Oh, oh, oh my god. That is totally a sign it's time to go to bed. Just about. Alright, who am I going to switch you with? Hmm. No, I don't think I'm going to switch you with anyone. Uh, nope. Gonna nickname you? Ah, uh, I must have accidentally said no to nicknaming already. Damn. Oh, well. Oh, uh, well. Whoa. What? Huh? What is... What is that? Oh, it's a Snorunt. Okay. Let's move on. Hmm, what is that? Oh. Oh! Yeah, I want one of those. Definitely want one of those. Aw, it's a Stuffle. That's so cute. It's like a little four-legged teddy bear. Okay. Let's, let's, uh, hit it with Pound, but I'm hoping that it's not a one-shot, but it's really close to a one-shot. Alright, come on. You even load my attack stats, so that should be good. Oh, what? <laughs> what? Even? Okay. Uh, right. It's like the exact opposite of a one-shot. <laughs> uh, yeah, okay. Uh, I'm gonna get Sobble out. <laughs> That's so bad. Oh, wow. Um, yikes. Okay. All right, yeah, you've done Leer, let's follow up with what? Pound or Water Gun? I don't want to go with Water Pulse because it's probably too powerful, so we'll just go with Water Gun. Yeah, that did good. Aww, <laughs> it flails. That's so cute. That is so cute. It's like, eh, I'm gonna paw you to death. Eh. Alright, uh, pound? Yeah, that'll do. Okay, good. And I think this might end up being my last catch. Unless we find another Pokemon. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. Nice, we got him. There is one other Pokemon that I will try and catch. But, we'll see if I can find it in the first place. Alright, Stuffle. The way it protects itself by flailing its arms may be an adorable sight, but stay well away. This is flailing that can snap thick tree trunks. Ew. Uh, okay. 
Oh, I have a sip of my coffee. Mmm. Because that's mildly terrifying. But um, only, only a little. <laughs> oh, man. That is some... Seriously deadly flailing. What are these? Oh. Okay, there are more stuffles. But uh, nope, no, 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 no. Let me get the W. Uh, okay, uh, maybe now isn't the best time for... Wait, what? Oh, this is an explanation of what it is. Okay. No, not an explanation of what it is, but... Ugh, okay, whatever. I'll just... Accept my fate that I'll never know what they actually are. Yikes. But I'll keep collecting them nonetheless, because I know that it'll probably pay off in the long run. Once I actually find out what it's for. Ugh. Uh, is there any other... Oh, there is. Yeah, that's right. Okay. Well, I might come back to that. I'm gonna go ahead towards the, uh... The town. Oh my god. All right, we've made it to Moto Stoke. Or Moto Moto Stoke? Mo Moto Stoke. Or just Moto Stoke. Hmm. Okay. I, 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 I give up on trying to pronounce that properly. Until I hear someone else say it. And it's confirmed that that's how you say it. I'm just going to do my best to pronounce it. If I offend someone because I got it wrong, too bad. I have no idea how to pronounce it. Uh, all right. Well, I'm just going to go to the focus Center and uh, heal up a bit. Oh, Sonia. Hey, over here. Okay. Sup, dude. You already at the focus Center? Hmm. Okay. Real ace of you to make it through the wild area. Why, thank you. Thank you. I intend on being a Pokemon master. I'll have you know. Okay. What's going on here? Oh. Are we going to get introduced to the Rotom in the actual computer? Oh. Oh. Okay. So you gave us a league card. I have no idea what the league card's for. But, um... Oh, okay. So we show up our achievements on the league card. Cool. Cool, 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 cool. Hmm. Uh. Alright. Well, uh... What do? Okay, you're just gonna. Okay, you're going. Bye. Cool. I'm a. I'm a heal up. I'm gonna heal up. And hmm, I'll probably. Yeah, guys, I'll probably end the video after this. Probably just uh, find a good place to park my character first, and then yeah, that's probably it for me for tonight. I'll. Uh, I'll be a uh, good example of. Um, Work-life balance, and uh, I will go to bed decently for once. All right. Anyway, Sonia, so brilliant young trainer, who's braved the wild area. Do you remember what your goal in Motostoke uh, is? Uh, I'm here for the gym challenge. Yep, the gym challenge opening ceremony. Cool. Yep, that's exactly what we're here for, to fight gyms and become a Pokemon League Master. By the way, the ceremony tomorrow is being held at the Modestoke Stadium. Okay. Okie dokie. Use that lift over there to get to the stadium, okay? Okay. Alright. Well, laters, I'm going to swing by the shops while I'm here. But don't forget to register at the stadium, okay? Uh, sure thing, man. Alright. Well, I'm gonna just go this way. 
And I'll probably leave my character right here. Yeah, this will do. This will do just fine. Ah, all right, guys. I've had a lot of fun recording this video. I am insanely tired. I've got to get to sleep. And the funny thing is I'll have to edit this video as quickly as possible after finishing this video. So... Oh my god, I gotta end it here. But anyway, look, I hope you guys enjoyed. I'm having so much fun playing Pokemon Sword and Shield. My throat is killing me. Um, I'm pretty sure it's because of, uh, like, all the yelling that um, occurred at uh, the midnight release. <laughs> uh, everyone was so loud and there were so many people, so it kind of just ended up being that people just talked really loudly. And, um, yeah, my, yeah, that's probably why my throat's super sore. Regardless, I'll rest up, sleep well, and, um, I'll have this thing edited and uploaded as quickly as possible. Alright, guys, thanks so, so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye bye